Arasaka conflict of the early 2020s, essentially all forms of life have been wiped clean from the megacity. Millions of people, animals, and plants were eradicated in a matter of minutes. 
and a similar fate awaits any to this day who strays too close to the southern edge of the Korean peninsula and the waters surrounding it. Though not all in the city lie still, automated systems powered by local tidal energy continue to operate unsupervised. Nedwatch has warned that without proper maintenance, any Busan-based AI could, in time, pose a considerable threat. Arisaka has washed their hands of the issue, placing full blame for the ecological and subsequent technical crisis with Militech, who dropped the bombs. NUSA President Rosalind Myers has declined to comment on the matter. Meanwhile in Europe, the Padanian government is once again in the midst of a campaign to prevent illegal excavations and looting in the city of Venice. Four looters and seven carabinieri were killed in the most recent altercation. This city, submerged under the Adriatic Sea, still hides many centuries old and priceless works of art. High demand from collectors has spurred on the continued looting. Official figures estimate the net worth of Venetian sculptures and jewelry sold illegally on the